Deirdre Van Madden is run down. Ah, uh, so, ah. Uh, Good morning, this is Rowan, and in case you haven't noticed, yes, I have disabled comments in that video. I do still indeed stand behind everything I've said in it, as I've said several times, but yeah. Uh, the thing that I decided to disable comments about is because y'all just wouldn't stop, would you? <laughs> I mean, that video is a month old, officially, in about 28 hours. Oh yes, 28 hours. And it's not that I've been keeping tabs on this, it's the fact that that's just how it is. It's the fact that in an effort to grasp at a renewal of relevancy, Ms. Eel has decided to drudge up a video that was already little over three weeks old at the time. I mean, we can all check the date stamps, can't we? Of course we can. And... She decided to keep it going. I mean... <laughs> and the thing is, is that th that video was already declining in views and minutes watched and even comments until Ms. Eel decided to uh, drop in her two cents. So, if anybody wants to accuse me of stirring the pot and causing drama, uh, think about who sent you to my channel. Just, just think about that. Look at their date stamps, look at mine. <sighs> yeah, how about that, huh? Because the fact of the matter is, is that I honestly did, you know, just... I let it go about a good couple hours after I posted that video. And... I would have let it be gone if that were completely up to me. You know, I said my piece, and I moved on with my life. And see, this is, this is where I was after I made the video. This is the time that he's elapsed. This is about where I would like to be. But this is where I am. Because this is where you all are. Think about that. You know it's true. So, like I said, this is the time that has elapsed since I made the video. This is where I would like to be. This is where I am. Because this is where you all are. And you keep trying to drag me back to your level. Because ideally I'd like to be here. I'd like to be this far moved on. But you keep pulling me back. And while I do keep pressing on after I delete the nastiest of your comments, I cannot bring myself up to speed until I disable them. So... I mean, I can, I can let you all continue to bully me. I can let you self-appointed little cronies of two of GothTube's biggest goddamn pathological narcissists. Um, I, I can let you try and drag me back to your level, or I can do what I need to so I can move on with my life. And... That is what I'm doing. 
maybe I'll reinstate comments, but probably not, because I have the sneaking suspicion that the very moment I do, you little self-appointed cronies are going to be right back there trying to drag me back down to your level, and quite frankly, yeah. Uh, I, as a as a street musician, as a servant to three gorgeous cats, as somebody with a laundry list of medical problems and a lot of really fascinating hobbies, including embroidery, um, baking, jigsaw puzzles and YouTube, and all of that. I, I would like to take that approximately half hour a day that I have been spending for the last month checking out comments for keywords to, depend, to decide whether or not they need to be deleted, and whether or not I need to engage, I would like to get that time back. I would like to devote that time to activities that are more relevant to my life, that are more fascinating to me, that are just more worthy of that time than to virtually babysit a bunch of little psychophants on the internet. So, as I have said many times before, I I'm, I'm moving on. I'm moving on. You all should too. Because people are gradually getting more and more sick of princesses' shit. And it will all hit the fan. And then we can all move on with our lives. And I'm sure many of you will come to realize that I was dead right about so many things including the fact that it, it seems she is physically incapable of telling the same lie to two different people. And this will catch up to her. Because, you know, one thing that I've noticed in all of the comments, in fact, I'm kind of regretting deleting some of the especially nasty ones, because it occurred to me that she has told at least four different stories to people. And these are just the ones that I recall. <laughs> four different stories. Some with wildly different explanations on how she even ended up in Germany in the first place. She's a liar and a pathological narcissist and a tax-dodging professional whiner. <gasps> if you catch that reference, you're probably a little bit cooler than I thought, but maybe not, who knows. Oh, what's Phoebe here? What's Phoebe here? Yeah, I know, Aquarium turns itself off. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Turns itself off. Little kitty got so alerted. Yes, mm-hmm. It's all right, though. The world needs more alerts, don't it, honey? Yes, it do. So, uh, so, yeah. Um, feel free to hit the like button or hit the dislike button, if you'd rather. Uh, feel free to subscribe and hit the little bell notification and all that. Or just ignore those suggestions and move on with your life. I have. I will. And...
I am going to have another Q&A uh, when I hit a thousand subscribers, because why the hell not, right? Right? Yes, I know. I know. It's past their dinner time. Right. Yes. Yes. And so, I need to go feed the cat's dinner. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I'm going to. Really? Do we need to look at your butt some more? Oh, plop. Yep. Okay, so I'm going to go feed the cat's dinner. And... Feel free to tell all of your friends. Uh, uh, check out my music uh, in the description box, not the comments. Artfire Shop is also in the description box, not the comments. And feel free to leave a comment. Uh, please keep in mind that I do delete comments if they uh, surpass a certain relatively arbitrary level of nastiness. And I do read just about all of them. If they get held f as potential spam, it might take me a while. I'm busy with my life. Right, kitty. Right. I'm especially busy with kitties. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I love our kitties. Kitties, 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 kitties. This is my life. My life is full of kitties. Yes, I am. Yes. Who are all these kitties? How'd they get here? Ah, <sighs> serendipity, voodoo, and because voodoo's old foster knew, I'm a sucker. Right. Right. Yes. Yes. Oh, I love ya. Oh, okay. You want the chair back. Yep. Okay. Yep. It's your chair, not mine. Ah. Uh, but yeah, feel free to like, subscribe, all that happy shit. If you want to see uh, three cats, especially this one, um, covering a loudmouth tiny gay in a wicker chair who does jigsaw puzzles and occasionally records music. Alright, bye-bye. Slon!